What's up guys, Shane Starts with Droid Miner X here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to add the Android M launcher to any device. So as you guys probably know by now, at Google I.O., Google announced the Android M Developer Preview build. Not only did they announce the Android M Developer Preview build, they went on ahead and released it to a few devices. So if you have a Nexus 5, a Nexus 6, or a Nexus 9, you can actually run the full preview build of Android M on your device right now. That leaves everybody else out. So if you have any other device like an awesome new Galaxy S6 Edge or an HTC One M9 or an LG G4, you're not able to run Android M until it is officially released by your OEM. All that being said, you can actually try out the Android M launcher right now uh, thanks to a modification called the Velvet APK. So if you head to the link in the description, uh, you, this is where you can actually find that modification. You'll need to go ahead and download the Google Now launcher from the Play Store. Uh, so before you go to the link in the description, go to the Play Store and search Google Now. Search for the Google Now launcher. Go ahead and install that. And once you have that installed, you'll be able to install the Velvet APK modification. So you go into uh, the link in the description will bring you here. Now you can install just the Android M launcher. There's also several other modifications that developer Foster F has uh, went on ahead and released. So you can have other things like the camera from Android M, the clock from Android M, play services, wallpaper, boot animations, ringtones, and then he even has an all-in-one flashable file. So if you want everything uh, that's included here, you can just install that via Team Win Recovery Project or Clockwork Mod Recovery uh, with just a simple flash. So if what you're looking for here though is the Android M launcher, what you'll do is scroll down to where it says download here. Click download here to bring up the full download page. So as you guys can see here, there's the wallpaper image. Uh, here's the all-in-one flashable. You can flash that in custom recovery. Uh, but what we want here is just the launcher. So we'll go ahead and download the Velvet APK. Okay, so choose direct download. Once it's finished downloading, you'll just simply install that app. So we'll just go ahead and install the application. It'll probably pop up a message asking you if you want to install the updated version of an application that you already have, or it'll tell you that it's replacing the app that you already have. Go ahead and accept that, and then it'll finish the install. Okay, so once it's finished, it'll say App Installed. You can go ahead and open it, and it's going to go ahead and launch the new Android M launcher on your device. Of course, if you click the Home button, and you don't already have that as your main launcher, it'll give you the option to make that your main launcher. That's what you'll want to do, and also click Always. Uh, so what you'll have now is just a very nice, fast, speedy launcher, which will include Google Now and OK Google. It'll include the all-new Android M app drawer. So this app drawer is super easy to use. Um, it took a little while to get used to the uh, vertical app drawer because we're always used to, most of, us in AO, most of us that are used to using AOSP Android, we're used to vertically scrolling through our app drawer. This just makes it really easy to find all of your apps. So you actually have a search bar here so you can... I uh, search for your favorite apps here if you have like a ton of apps which many of you do have lots and lots of apps but say I wanted to find Facebook I would just type and it would come right up okay the other thing that you can do here is actually just grab the side here and it'll scroll through alphabetically nice and quick and then of course everything is just already laid out alphabetically here which just makes it easier to find uh, all together. Okay, so the other thing that it changes here is the widget screen. So if we pull up our widgets, those were horizontally scrolling in versions prior to Android M. Now they are also vertically scrolling. But anyways guys, that about wraps it up for this quick tutorial on how to install the Android M launcher to any Android phone. Uh, quick note, this works on devices with KitKat or Lollipop. It will not work on anything that came out prior to KitKat, so just kind of keep that in mind. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.